Okay, everyone, welcome back. Let's play a castle. And get more potions. Now here are these floors all just cycle around in one big loop. So it's not connected in any sort of complicated way. And actually you can get more of these weapons. You look, that treasure chest reappeared. Well, I've never actually gotten it a second time. You shouldn't need more weapons than this, than this but I'm assuming it refills. Anyway, this potion, watch out for the center. Make sure to move away from it when you're falling. This is the best route that I've found to progress. There's a number of ways you can do this, but this way gets you the potion and it gets you out fairly fast. Don't jump in there, that'll put you back in the cycle again. These guys are frustrating. Trying to play defensively, but it's not really working too well. That's I think I lied. I think there are actually five potions in this place. Because if I had have two, well, three. I know there's two coming out. That's for sure. And I was three. So yeah, five in this place, which is awesome. So I'd still like to get to the boss with two or three, ideally. But, I don't know, these guys keep delaying me. Whoa. There we go. Yeah, don't be afraid to knock these guys out if it, it's going to be safer. Okay. Now this guy is kind of a mini-boss. In a way. He's a new enemy. You rarely see two of them in a room, so... He's kind of a jerk, too. Anyway, not nothing too scary, but... But these bats can actually hurt you, hurt you more than anything else in this place. They can be the most dangerous thing, which is so quick. Okay. Whoa. Aha! But you didn't know about that, did you? Well, I think I should just ignore them for now. Again, don't be afraid to knock them out. Just play it safe. Awesome. Yeah, I was too close. <laughs> Tana, you! Tana, me? Get over here. Okay, I guess I didn't really have to kill them, but... Okay. Yikes, yeah, this guy's a new enemy. Just don't attack the orbs that he drops, or they'll shoot right at you. Like that. Ow. Potion, don't forget. So it's actually pretty easy if you're if you can avoid shooting. There we go. Just take your time with that guy. Yeah, there's quite a few rooms in this place that I avoided. I think there's more than one of those bubble guys too. I just kind of took the best path and avoided some of them. But look, it's an actual door. Wow. It even looks like a door. And our last potion. Give me my treasure. 
Whoa. Careful. Yeah, more than enough weapons. More than enough. Okay. Somewhere in here is a floor tile. Beware bats. Beware the bats. Okay. Almost there. Now, try not to jump too much, because I've accidentally killed myself several times in this place. Okay, let's get some longer range on this guy. Hey, his projectiles look just like mine. jumping in this room. That's what I recommend. Because I've killed myself many times, like I said. Okay. A few more bats, and we're free to go. Oh, there's... Oh, another potion. Does that make six? Really? Six potions? Wow. Well, there's either five or six, and we will probably use all of them. I think this next room is the boss. Yes, it is. Stay away from those spikes. It may sound easy, but it's really not. And don't jump into the pit. Again, sounds obvious, but it can be done. Ow. I don't know, the dagger might be a bit stronger than this thing, but I like versatility in the range. Ow. I should probably be jumping to avoid those triple sauce a little more. But I, don't, I know you can get between them if you're careful. Maybe not. I'm too slow. Not over yet. No, it's not. Be the potion. Again, don't jump in the pit. Mostly jump sideways. Seems to be the safer bet. Ooh, that went better than expected. Potion just to be safe. Don't jump. Hooray! I'm a victor. Not the victor, a victor. Wow, you've done it! It's like all the tetrad except for the L shape. I have the backwards L, but not the actual L. Good luck. Good luck indeed. For a kill. Five so far. A total of six. Life nice level increased. Three more hearts to go. You've done it! 
for once. I don't know why an ancient time traveling book is called the Oxford World Wonder, but I guess Oxford has been around for a thousand years. Anyway, we get to decide where we're going, sort of. Okay, don't be defective. Don't be defective. Send me to a real place. Better not be a fictional place. Chapter 8! A winner is you. Okay, we're drastically out of time. We're in a forest. Don't worry, it's not fictional. I promise. See you.